What's up guys? I hope you're well. Today I'm checking out something that one of you guys recommended to me. It is Bird and Fortune and we're going to check out Pub Conversation. Let's get into it, shall we? <laughs> I've made up my mind. I'm going to get a shotgun license. I don't think that's very wise, Leslie. That your eyes aren't what they used to be. Well, I have my eyes closed when I press the trigger, so it won't make much difference, really. <laughs> but I mean, what do you want a gun for? <clears throat> oh, are you and Audrey going through one of your rough patches? No, no, no. It's, 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 it's nothing to do. It's intruders. Mm. Intruders. Right. I'm allowed to shoot intruders now, aren't I? I mean, yeah. under the guidelines. Yes, yes, you are. But you must make sure that your actions are what? Proportionate and not excessive. Exactly. <laughs> I don't understand that. I mean, how can you shoot somebody proportionately? <laughs> you're, you're supposed to make the bullet come out slower if there are right. mitigating circumstances. Have you had many intruders? Because you were pretty quiet. Yes. No, I haven't had any intruders. Oh. None, none at all, in fact. No. But I will. I mean, I know I will. Not... Do you know who they are? Oh, yeah, I know exactly who they are. They're, <laughs> they're uh, canvassers, you know, political... <laughs> The general election is going to be an absolute nightmare. But you can't shoot them, Leslie. They're part of the democratic process. I'm not having it. Look, last, last time there was a council elections, yes. I, I was in bed asleep, see, mm. and I, in the middle of the night, and I heard this terrible noise. Mm. Audrey. No, no, no. <laughs> no it, 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 wasn't, it wasn't Audrey, or the plumbing, or Audrey's plumbing. And it, yes. was, it was... I didn't know what it was. I crept downstairs, you know, mm. carrying one of Audrey's training weights, and, and <laughs> I opened the door, and blow me, it was a Liberal Democrat, a chap from... This is 3 o'clock in the morning. And you said, do I want to discuss their policy on paternity leave? I mean, I'm 72 years old. <laughs> I know, I know. But the thing is, uh, Leslie, in order to make an informed choice, you have to listen to the audience. Well, and I don't uh, think you realise what powers you have. Well, I mean, what, I mean, they don't take any notice of old people now. Nonsense. It's the grey vote. It's yes. you and me, Leslie. Mm -hmm. uh, and that's why Gordon Brown groveled so much to us in the, in the budget. Well, I <laughs> grovel. I think yes. groveled a bit more for my, for my liking. <laughs> what? Well, look, he gave us a, a rebate on our council tax. Uh, for, for one year only, and it yeah. happened to be an election year. Mm. I mean, Isn't that funny how that works, huh? Why did you put it in a box, wrap it up in ribbon, and write a bribe on it? <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> that, is, that, that is so freaking accurate at, um, how the political system is, that all these people who are in office who are up for re-election do something to... Uh, kind of sugar, you know, sugar up, sweeten up uh, the voters, which I think needs uh, to uh, be stopped. So you're, you're saying this, as it were, demonstrates, you know, how important we are. Isn't well, it? yes, yeah. and, and, and much more now, because unlike most other people, people like you and me actually go out and vote. Yes, sure. well, we are public spirited, aren't we? Well, we are. Yes. And also, we don't have anything else to do. No. <laughs> <laughs> And that's why we've been targeted more than we've ever been by the political well, parties. That, that, that right. makes it that'll make it worse. There'll be even more can canvassers coming mm. coming round and, mm. and disturbing. And what's the point of it? We know what they're going to say before they start. The Labour Party will say, uh, "What law would you like pass? Any yes. law? Yes. What can we frighten you with now?" That's what yeah. they'll, they'll, they'll say. That. And the Tories will just say, "Is anybody in here with a medical condition?" <laughs> <laughs> Damn. I mean, don't turn your nose up at that. Or you could be famous for a whole day. It's, it's people power. Mm. I mean, think of Audrey's bladder. Oh, God, don't. <laughs> Audrey's bladder has been hanging over our heads for a year. <laughs> and the hospital won't give us an appointment for the operation. Well, you, you'll use that oh, as, a, as a lever. Really? You see, Audrey's yeah. bladder could be another Mrs. Dixon's shoulder. Well, yeah. how? Sure. How? Well, some political party is going to get hold of Audrey's bladder yes. and run with it. Yeah. <laughs> and, and one morning you'll wake up and find it all over the front page of the Daily Telegraph. <laughs> it could be a core celeb. You know, mm. the battle of Audrey's bladder. Well, the last thing I want is for Audrey's bladder to turn into a political football. Wow. Oh, yes. 
so good. That's so funny. But, I mean, this is our opportunity, Leslie. I mean, mm -hmm. you know, we can be the power brokers in the next parliament. No, no, they, they, they'll just say, as soon as the election's over, they'll forget about us. They'll say these people are going to be dead soon. No, that isn't right. What? Because what? science, I read this in the, in the Saga magazine. <laughs> yeah. Yes, I did. Uh, science is on the brink of being able to make us all immortal. Oh, no, that's never, never do that. Oh, God, no, please, no. It's, it's happening oh, no. already. I mean, there are some rich men, businessmen in America, who are having themselves frozen after they die, so that when... Ted Williams, American baseball player. When science comes along with the answer, they can be brought back to life. Walt Disney, American entertainer, another one. Really? Yes, I mean, sometimes <laughs> they, they freeze the whole body, and sometimes they just freeze... The head. Yep. <laughs> the head? Just the head. That was Ted Williams. So what happens? They wake, the head wakes up in 100 years time and says, yes. I'm just going to nip down to the post office. <laughs> Pretty much. Well, I mean, how, do they, how does he do it? Well, I suppose they'll roll. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's, that's, that's not very likely, is it? No, really? it's not very likely. likely. Oh. No. Because in, in a hundred years' time, there probably won't be a post office. That's probably. <laughs> <right. laughs> um, but it, I mean, uh, there hardly is one now. Hardly is one now. No, no. But I mean, there, there's, there's not going to be much of a, of a social life if you're just a head. Is it? Well, I mean, I can't imagine me just as a head picking up some old lady and saying, "Would you like to go down to the Lyceum for a spot of, you know, a strictly ballroom?" <laughs> it would look ludicrous. Yes. The tango, the only bit of the tango I could do would be that. that <laughs> and then my hat would fall off. <laughs> That's true. But on the other hand, the old lady who pick up, uh, she might be ahead as well. It's yes, more than likely. True. Yes, it You'll is, get on like a house on fire. Mm. <laughs> because two heads are better than none at all. <laughs> true. <laughs> No, but you know, I mean, I don't know whether I can face living for... I mean, I, the idea of getting up for year, hundreds of years cleaning my teeth every morning, I couldn't yeah. stand it. And in any case, you know, we're old people, we're set in our ways. We, you, we wake up, we wouldn't know where we were. Everything uh, would have changed yeah. so much in a hundred years' time. Well, some things won't have changed. Mm. I mean, Gordon Brown will still be Chancellor. That's, <laughs> <laughs> That's good. <clears throat> oh, man, they hit a couple things that made me go, oh, uh -huh, that's about right. Both my parents are roughly, you know, these gentlemen's age in this clip. And, uh, yeah, I mean, these political parties are just you know, hassling them all over them. Even their, like, non-election years. It's it's like, Jesus Christ, man, let it be. <laughs> but uh, I really enjoyed this. I'm gonna, I kind of want to check out more uh, Bird and Fortune. Let me know down in the comments. If there's any bird and fortune you would like me to check out. But until then, I want to thank you all for watching. Stay safe and don't forget to wash your hands. Bye.